Trip Shop Adventures, Secret Santa, Take 5. Hi, my name is Joe Hewitt. Uh, I was absolutely thrilled when I found out that I had drawn Matt Sandbook's name as my Secret Santa target for 2007. Uh, like me, I happen to know that Matt is a huge fan of old school Japanese animation. In fact, not many people know this, but Chip Shop Adventures is actually based on a 1950s era anime called God Tempura Force Go. God Tempura Force was created by one of the pioneers of Japanese animation, Mr. Seifuku Okonomiyaki, shown here in 1952. Now, ever since it was banned in 1973, God Tempura Force has been one of the hardest animes to find. It's even rarer, in fact, than that episode of Naruto, where the creepy-looking kid gets caught whacking off. Anyway, um, a deal has been reached earlier this year between Moonlight Pony Studios and the government of Belgium that would allow God Tempura Force to be released once again. And they put out a DVD. It's great. Uh, let's take a look at some of the scenes, actually, and you can see the classic beauty of one of the true masters of animation. I think you'll agree, they don't make cartoons like this anymore. Yamate. What? Ah! 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 Incredible. Now, some fans complain about the changes that Matt made to God Tempura Force, such as, for instance, he relocated the chip shop from Utah to Nevada, and he made the character Sheena not be a lesbian. But personally, I think that Seifuku Okonomiyaki would have been proud. Sadly, though, he did not live to see any of this, having been stabbed to death by Leiji Matsumuro at Comic-Con in 1962. 2008 is going to be a big year for Chip Shop Adventures. Matt has just finished The Clown Saga, which was the last storyline featured in the original. Through Matt's work, God Tempura Force lives on, and indeed, will never die. Word to your mother, Mrs. Sandbrook.